you know, it feels to me like they wanted to take their time. They wanted to be a player, okay? They wanted to do what they wanted to do. And then when they were ready to settle down, then they were going to come your way. And that you were just going to be waiting there, sitting and waiting. And you were like, no, I'm not doing that. F that. I'm not waiting for you. Okay, they wanted, to, they wanted to keep you stuck, wanted to, you know, for some of you, they were preparing to sacrifice you. This individual was emotionally unavailable. Okay, I do see there's a lot of secrecy surrounding this person. You don't really know who this person is. I feel like it's been a very rough few months, okay? These past few months, a lot of stuff is surfacing that you're having to deal with. Don't give anybody your money, okay? Your dreams, your aspirations, keep it low. Keep, keep, keep this quiet, okay, Sagittarius? Spirit is sounding the red alarm. Keep this stuff quiet for now. Do a cleanse after this read. Do a cleanse after this read. I'm just letting you know right now. This is messy. This is messy. This is foul. Okay, this is all types of foul. God has seen what this person has been doing. Okay, they had their fill. Like, it, this is so disgusting. I, I'm normally not one to judge, but this is just disgusting. Okay, I'm gonna be honest. This is disgusting, and this is the lowest... This is the lowest of the low, okay? I just have to hold this Palo Santo just to protect my energy. This is foul. This is gross. I feel dirty stepping into this energy. This person wants to have their fill. They want to have their cake and eat it. You know what I'm getting? They're saving you for last because you're the best for last. That's how gross this is. They're saving the best for last, which is you, Sagittarius. Now, I'm not going to judge, I, I never judge, but I do feel like this person is like, they're, they definitely have a sex addiction. They have, they have to get help. They need help. Okay, they need serious help. Yeah, three of wands, they just left you waiting. They're like, oh, when I'm done doing this, when I'm done having fun, then I will come home to Sagittarius. Yes, look, look at this. It's going to be right over the third party. What did I say, Sagittarius? For a lot of you, this person is out here entertaining different people. Okay? There has been a spiritual court hearing on you, Divine Feminine, and your Divine Masculine. And the court has ruled in your favor. Okay? They have ruled in your favor. And judgment has been made. Okay, not just on this individual, but a lot of third parties, okay? You really need to protect your energy this time around. Like, you, you really have to. You really need to, okay? If you are resonating with this message, please, please, please promise me that you are going to protect your energy. Because there are some sick people around some of you, and some of you are not seeing it. Hello, my beautiful... Sagittarians, how are you? Welcome back to the channel. Starcy Zayed here. If you're new, make sure to subscribe and join the Soul Tribe. We have a read for you guys. This is a general read. So we're going to see what spirit has for you guys. Do take what resonates, leave what doesn't behind. Cross watchers, you are welcome. This message is also timeless. Personal reads are in the link tree link in the description box below. And with all that out of the way, we're going to get started, my beautiful Sagittarius. Oh, you have grief and loss. Um very small portion of you could see a death in the family or like somebody you know could be like passing on okay yikes i, I hate to start this but also i feel like it's been very <sighs> i feel like it's been a very rough few months okay these past few months a lot of stuff is surfacing that you're having to deal with oh yeah spirit is really wanting you to take a break right now okay a lot of you this may not be for everybody we have get active as well. So spirit is wanting you to take a break, but also get active. Like, get active in your health, okay? Your mental health, your physical health, your spiritual health. Here we have boundaries. So I do see here there are some people that they just need to stay away from you. <laughs> uh, yeah, they just need to... You just need to send them their way, like... Like, some people just don't need to be near you, okay? You're Sagittarius, you're on another level, okay? This is not a narcissist thing, this is not a selfish thing. You're just on another level. They're a muggle, they're a zombie, okay? They're asleep, they don't need to be in your energy. Your energy is very pure, okay? Yeah, healing the earth, okay? You're an empath, a lot of you. So you have love, humility, and respect, okay? 
Respect yourself enough to walk away. Some of you need to hear that. Not all of you. Not all of you. But some of you do need to hear that. You know, hold hold the line. Have integrity. Okay? You have sacred journey. So spirit is getting ready to send you on a journey. Some of you may say, oh, I'm not going anywhere. I'm staying where I'm at. No, spirit has other plans. Okay? Spirit has bigger plans for you, Sagittarius. So let's see the dice and then we'll get into the tarot. We have number three. The Empress, you're stepping into your divine feminine energy, regardless of your gender, okay? You're you're the divine feminine, okay? You're in your Empress energy. You have Aquarius here, your Anus energy as well. You are meant to be in the spotlight, okay? We could see the star card. We could also see the Empress. And look at that. You're going to have Aquarius, but you're also going to have Leo with the sun. You have opposites here, okay? Two very, very strong signs. Very strong signs. Both of these are fixed signs, you could be dealing with a twin flame situation, some of you, or you're about to be reunited with your twin flame. Thank you so much, angels, ancestors, spirit guides, universe, galactic beings, ancient ancestors, elders, guide us in this read for my beautiful Sagittarians. What messages do you have for them? Truly grateful for your divine guidance and celestial light. Okay. Two... And three. Whoa, that King of Wands went flying out. Oh, okay. So we have the King of Wands, but what do we have with this King of Wands spirit? What do we have? The Emperor. Okay, yes. So unfortunately, I do see here you've been dealing with a divine counterpart. Okay, Twin Flame soulmate, Karmic soulmate, um, whatever it may be. You have a very spiritual connection with this person, Sagittarius. But I do see here that this individual is a little bit of a player. Okay, they have strong fire strong fire we're seeing leo aries sag but we're seeing strong aries energy here um definitely strong leo energy okay very strong leo energy you could have a lot of leo in your chart or this person but leo can be very promiscuous okay leo and scorpio they tend to be quite promiscuous so it's like and and that's not just like that's one of the bad aspects of those signs right i'm a leo right so i know you know, and I have Scorpio everywhere in my chart. So it's like, you know, I'm not pointing the finger. Like, anybody can be like that. But I'm just saying, this is the bad aspects of those signs specifically is their player ways, wanting to play games, okay? But anybody can do that. Any sign can do that. But it's just, you know, that's something that can be quite the thing when it comes to leos and scorpios because they're very passionate okay they're very sexual okay and sensual very romantic okay here we have the four of pentacles we have nine of cups definitely hold on to your money don't give anybody your money sagittarius i don't know why i have to say this but somebody here needs to hold on to their money don't give anybody your money okay your dreams your aspirations keep it low keep 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 this quiet okay sagittarius spirit is sounding the red alarm Keep this stuff quiet for now, okay? There, There's Crosswatcher, whoever is watching this. You need to keep this stuff quiet, okay? Kind of pull back your energy. If you want, you can, you know, post photos of, like, the mountains or, like, you at a soccer game, you know, a football, a college football, you know, like, you doing stuff that isn't really going to give people information about what you're working on because or how much money you have. Because there's people here, they're spying in. Eight of Swords. I don't like this energy. I don't like it. Oh my god. The Moon and the Eight of Cups. People are trying to keep you stuck. It's very important right now to protect your energy. Also, I see here your Divine Masculine. He, she, them, they, it. Is holding on to your energy. They're holding on for dear life because you're their wish fulfillment. Okay, they want you. But they haven't done anything. Okay, I do see there's a lot of secrecy surrounding this person. You don't really know who this person is, is what I'm picking up on as well. Like, you really don't. You know, this person has only shown you 5% of who they truly are. Okay, there's a lot of secrets surrounding this person. A lot of you are getting unstuck February, and I'm seeing you guys walking away, okay? But definitely keep your money, hold tightly to your money. Sagittarius, don't tell anybody about your finances, Okay. Nobody needs to know. This, this is nobody's business. You can put the boundary. Your family doesn't need to know. Your parents don't need to know. Right? Like, if people are coming to you and putting you in a private 
spot, you know, and they're asking questions like, oh, well, you know, how's work and how's money going? Like, how much are you pulling in? You know, you need to start, like, that's why we have boundaries here. Okay, that's why I came out, like, okay, go away. You know, like, they don't need to know that. That's not their business. You need to hold on to this because Spirit is about to bless you with even more. Okay, so we have the Fool here, the Three of Pentacles, the Eight of Wands, the Five of Swords. I do see here a lot of you are in separation with someone, but this individual is coming back in. They want a brand new beginning rate. The Fool is there, card number zero. We're starting over again. Three of Pentacles, they want to collab, and Eight of Wands and the Five of Swords. They want a message, but they're scared that there's going to be a confrontation between the two of you, Okay. Yeah, I do see here the Queen of Wands. Like, you really, you have to watch out with your energy. You have to watch out here because it feels to me like there's some third-party stuff, okay? I do see here for some of you, this individual went with someone else. They chose someone else over you. The Chariot, right? They had two choices. You see the two Sphinxes right there? One's black and one's white. They had two choices and they chose the wrong person, okay? The Three of Cups, yeah. The third-party energy is very, very strong. What can I say here? You have a divine pair. You have the emperor and the empress. You guys are supposed to be a match made in hell, but it's like, that's not happening. I do get this energy here that you, you have to remove yourself. Okay, some of you have not. I do still think this person is coming back in. Seven of cups, mm, ten of cups. Knight of Pentacles. Somebody new is coming in, okay? I do see this individual from the past that had this third party, this player, this F-boy, F-girl, whoever. I do see them coming in. That's why we have number three. It's going to be a love triangle situation because this individual is coming back in. They're holding onto your energy, but you also have somebody else here, this Knight of Pentacles that's coming in, okay? They've been watching you. Okay, the Seven of Cups, they see you. They've been watching you or they've heard about you feels to me like they've known you or like they've been watching you from a distance here but they see you as their wish fulfillment okay this is a high level soulmate um it's not the person that you were destined to be with for a lot of you but you know we got to keep the show going um we we can't slow it down like some of you some of you are meant to have kids okay and it's like you were supposed to have kids with this person over here this divine masculine or you were supposed to adopt kids, whatever it may be, but it didn't happen. Because they have this Queen of Wands. They're over here as the King of Cups. They're over here entertaining somebody else. They have a lot of third-party energies, but what I also get here, a lot of third parties trying to interfere with you, Sagittarius. For some of you, magic is involved, so you definitely want to light a protection candle, okay? Okay. Um, watch the candle, watch the candle, or you want to get black obsidian, okay, and specifically speak it, I am using this black obsidian to protect my energy, to block out all negative energy, right, claim it, affirm it, right, or you can get organite, an organite pyramid, but yeah, people are trying to get into your energy, and some people could be sending you magic, or, you know, you don't even need to get any of this, you could just affirm it out loud, I pull back all my energy i claim all my energy for me any magic being sent my way is returned to the sender it has no effect on me my energy is protected etc etc just affirm it because there's people here they're trying to send you the voodoo okay here we have temperance yeah. people are talking and they're saying stuff about you. yeah look look you can't make it up it's this this the divine counterpart you're gonna have the emperor right over it come on now this individual was emotionally unavailable. But look, look, you you can't make it up. You can't make it up. Look at this, Sagittarius. They want to come back in. They want to come back in. They want to rebuild this. What did I say? The Fool. They want a brand new beginning. They want a fresh start with you. Literally, you have the Fool over there. Look, the Chariot. Oh my God. Look at this. The Chariot over here, right? With the Queen of Swords. Some of you are dealing with a Cancer. And with the Queen of Wands. Now you have it over here with the Queen of Wands. Two of Swords. This individual was undecided, but now they're realizing that you're the one. You're the goat. You're the greatest of them all. 
and they're stressing. They're terrified that they're going to lose you. Oh, no, no, no. You see, this is why this person's rushing back in. This person, they feel like you're theirs, Sagittarius. They know that this other person is about to come in, this Knight of Pentacles. They know because they have a strong telepathic bond with you. That's why they're rushing in. And they might even be love bombing you. Look, the lovers. You're going to have to make a choice here. But, but both of these individuals, they're shady stuff here. This new person is not being entirely honest about their past relationship. I'm just going to leave it at that. They might, you know, just make sure that you know the full story about this past person. You know, they could have been married. Here we have the Ten of Cups. A lot of people want to happily ever after with you. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You have a new person here. You do. This individual has been manifesting you. They've been trying to manifest you. But you have judgment. For some of you, you could be dealing with the strong water energy. You could be dealing with a Cancer or Scorpio. Three of Pentacles. Ooh, for the devil. There's a lot of third-party stuff going on. You really have to protect your energy. Three of Cups. Yeah, you keep getting all these threes. You keep getting all these threes, Sagittarius. You need to protect your energy. Okay, you need to retreat right now. Don't post a lot of information about your life right now, okay? Just focus on yourself right now because I do feel like two two lovers here are coming in. Somebody that you've been on and off with, okay? Your divine counterpart that has been BSing this whole entire time. And there's also a new person. But I also feel like a lot of other people want to come in. But they're not at your level. They're not where you're at. Okay? They're not going to be a good match with you. These other these other individuals, okay? This new person and the divine counterpart, they're at your level. Even if they you know, even if things have been rocky with this individual, they do have potential. You know, there's a reason why spirit paired you with this person. They see the potential with you and this individual. It's just that this individual is BSing. But I do feel like because they see you as a possession, they see you as theirs. They don't want this other person. They don't want this other person to have you, Sagittarius. So it's like now they're rushing in. You know, it feels to me like they wanted to take their time. They wanted to be a player. Okay, they wanted to do what they wanted to do. And then when they were ready to settle down, then they were going to come your way. And that you were just going to be waiting there, sitting and waiting. And you were like, no, I'm not doing that. F that. I'm not waiting for you. If you're not going to give commitment now, see you later. Some of you even said it to them. And they were they were spooked. They were shook. So now they're in full-blown full blown panic. They're watching everything. Okay, the devil here. They don't want to lose control. But they're also hanging around somebody else. And it's like, what the hell? This individual, this divine masculine of yours. Holy crap. Okay, so we have death and karmic cycle. Yeah, yeah, you're you're gonna shut the cycle. You really need to protect your energy, my love. Okay, you 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 just have to. Okay, cleanse your energy. Be careful. Some of you need to be careful who you're hanging out with because you the devil. I don't like this energy. I'm just gonna be honest. There's a lot of hidden enemies. Okay, there's a lot of things that you need to close out. Some of you, a lot of you have already done it, but you have that boundaries card. So it's very important right now to cleanse and protect your space. Yeah, you have the devil again, Sagittarius. You have the devil twice. Very important right now to cleanse your space, to protect your energy, okay? The sun is there. Everything's going to come to light, okay? And Aquarius, Uranus energy. Uranus is rebellious. It's going to break the status quo. Uranus doesn't care. Uranus is going to do what it wants to do. And this is what you need to do, Sagittarius. You need to do what you want to do. You can't hold back for these individuals. Like, okay, they are they were over here wanting to play mind games. Okay, well, that's okay. Like, I forgive you, but I'm going to still live my best life. That sort of energy. Yeah, leadership. You're bossing up. You're in the divine feminine, regardless of your gender. Okay, you're really bossing up. Yeah, see, look, you can't make it up. Abundance. Blessings is headed your way. What did I say in the beginning of the read, Sagittarius? Blessings are heading your way. Lots of blessings, lots of abundance. Protect your energy. Don't tell people. What did I say, Sagittarius? Do not tell people about your money. It is not their business. They don't need to know. They don't need to know. 
by all means, if you wish to tell them about your money, do so and watch the consequences of that. Spirit is telling you, do not. If, if, if you, you know, you really have to start asking yourself, could you trust these people with your money? You know, if anything were to happen to you. And it's a yes or no question. It's yes or no. If you're like, uh, well, okay, it's a no. You you can't trust them. You just can't. You're, it's either going to be a yes or a no, and you're going to know. Can you trust these people with your money? Purpose. Yeah, these people were trying to... There was a lot of karmic energy. Some of you could have been in an abusive family, abusive household, abusive marriage. And it's like these people made a deal with the devil. Okay, they wanted to, they wanted to keep you stuck, wanted to, you know, for some of you, they were preparing to sacrifice you, basically destroy you, okay, and that was it. They knew that you were a light worker, okay, the evil spirits that they were communicating with, they knew, Sagittarius, they knew, they knew that you had a big mission here to heal the planet, and they wanted to stop, and they failed, they failed, they're failing. They also, Sagittarius, if you're single, if you've been single for a while, they were doing magic to keep you from meeting your divine counterpart. Or they were doing magic to, um, you know, because I feel like your divine masculine is not that spiritual. So they were doing magic to control and influence this person's mind. And that's why this person was acting the way they were towards you. Because people, close people, for some of you, close people were doing the black magic. They were doing the voodoo. I'm gonna, I'm just gonna say, it. yeah, third party. A lot of third parties, three, the number three keeps coming up. Like, you really need to protect your energy and kind of do your own thing for now. Divine timing. Because, you know, it's almost like you're in the, like, you're getting ready to give birth. You're in labor, right? But you don't really know when the baby is going to come out. And that's what's happening here. You're about to birth this new, you know, this new life. You're about to head on this new beautiful journey. But it's like you're in this waiting period, okay? I'm, I'm I think I'm gonna do an extended, okay? I think I'm gonna do an extended for this because I want to see what's going on with your divine counterpart. I also want to see this new person headed your way. I also want to see what this is talking about. These third parties, this boundaries card. So I think I'm gonna do an extended. It will be in the link in the description box below, okay? It will be through Gumroad. It's not gonna be through my site. So Gumroad, if you're doing it on mobile, you do need to download an app in the App Store. It is free, okay? It is on the Google Play Store or the Android Store, and it is on the um, the iPhone App Store. I forgot what it's called, but you get what I'm saying. If you're on desktop, you can buy it, and then it will say download or watch. You just have to click watch. If you want to download the read, you can, but you don't have to do that. You can just watch the read. You know, and it will, it should start playing, right? If you have any issues, just um, let me know. Or you could even, I'm not going to recommend this because that would be a case against me. But if you can't get to the read, if you can't get to the read, I'll link my email or reach out to my Instagram, Starcy Zayed, okay? But yeah, that is your read, my beautiful Sagittarius. Your angels are protecting you and they are showing here reconciliation. So if you want this divine counterpart, but what I also get with reconciliation, there are people from the past that want, want to get back in your energy. Your angels want you to protect your energy. So that is your read. I wish you the best of luck. And I wish you